Good afternoon, YouTube. Not good morning because we had a lot of running around and we're just now getting down to breakfast. And then Real Babe's got her phone earlier today, which is cool. But then at five, I'm taking off to meet Jose and we're gonna do some caiman hunting. I went with a waffle sandwich. We are heading back to Arecibo to see what's going on with a video upload that's not uploading. And then I think we're gonna look at some more houses. The first house we looked at, I didn't get it on video, but I think I'm gonna drive back by, is right in the downtown area of Hatillo. And we are coming up to the plaza. So this house is 60K, it's a HUD home. We're looking first and foremost, just something for ourselves while we are down here working. And then as an investment, possibly long-term rental or short-term, there's the mission or the church. Um, as far as Airbnb, vacation rentals, here is the plaza. And I am gonna take y'all around the plaza, YouTube. There's the fountain. And we've been through here quite a bit. We enjoy this little plaza. Okay, I'm gonna exit the plaza and I'm gonna take y'all up to the house. We haven't done the wave test in this neighborhood yet. So I'm gonna drop some windows, let some of the AC out and we're gonna start doing some waving. We just got a good wave. That was the first wave. Let's see what else we can produce. Okay, y'all, there's been a group of dogs hanging out in front of this building all day, and they just had a pig join them. <laughs> there's the pig, and there's the assorted dogs that have been there all day. Wink, wink. Oh, he's coming over here. <laughs> Maybe. He... Hi, pig, pig. I'm gonna back up and get more pig video. Well, that is a boar. You can see his tusk. And he's been doing pig stuff, scratching and rubbing. There he goes. Hey, pig, pig. Hey, buddy, how are you? Yeah. Are you gonna come get, the... maybe he'll eat one of your dog biscuits. <laughs> maybe the pig will eat one of your dog biscuits. Maybe. I don't know how much of that was videoing. I think the camera actually turned off on me. Laura's now trying to get a dog biscuit for the pig. Don't let him get you with them big old tusk. Uh, I bet he'll eat a dog biscuit. Would you like a dog biscuit? He's gonna investigate it. You might have a winner. If the pig doesn't eat your dog biscuit, I will never feed milk bones to another animal. Oh, he doesn't like it. I, yeah, I, I think he's, you know, he's not down with the dog biscuits. Nobody likes your dog biscuits. Nobody likes milk bones on this island. Even starving dogs won't eat my milk bones. Yeah. Aw, he looks sweet, but I'm scared to pet him. <laughs> Goodbye, friendly pig bud. Okay, we had fun with the piggy. He got scared. I started talking about roasting him. And now we're gonna go up to the house. It looks like a boxer. It's a good looking dog. Mm -hmm. Here it is. Can't really see much. Somebody is looking at it now. Mm -hmm. She saw me video and I got a mean look. The pig is just nosed up to a fence down the block. Laura thinks he is friends with a dog that lives there. I don't know. Well, they had a dog, beware of dog sign there, and there was a lady inside. So either she's feeding him or he has a dog homie in there. The pig is known to hang out with dogs. That's what he does. The pig got bored. He's back hanging out with the dogs again. I really like the bearded dog. Like, I would run with that crew. It's like a wiener dog, a chihuahua, a bearded dog, and the boar pig. 
I would totally chill with them. Electrical and plumbing situation is like, you know, this is just work closure and we don't know if it's working at the moment or not. Okay. They sold it. We're gonna see what kind of view we have from the top. You don't look happy. Oh. Could it work? Oh. I mean, it could work. Yeah. No ocean view. No. But you can see the neighbor's horse. <laughs> what did the realtor tell us about that house and neighborhood? Uh, basically that if we were considering actually living there ourselves, it might not be our best choice. Um, she was very conscious in how she articulated this, but um, it sounds like most of the people there are renters, not owners, and it's all like Section 8. Um, there seemed to be a good bit of drug activity. It was quiet during the day, but at night it's a whole different story. Yes. We just procured the last few items we needed from Walmart. Some rope, some painter's tape, stuff like that and now we're heading up to jose's we had a boat part failure we just got the call so we're gonna go eat sushi well which means we're not going cayman hunting tonight because of the boat failure <laughs> <laughs> I know. I saw that river cross. Hold that for 25 cents. I think it's five cents. It might be five cents. No, you have no change from me too. Oh wow. Oh yeah. That's pretty cool. I don't think we've been to this plaza. This is the Barceloneta Plaza. Yes. Barceloneta is big into sports. We have a bowling alley. We have a. Pool and arrow, we have uh, swimming pools, Boy we got a little bit flat. of everything. Is this really uh, we do have a paintball. So. Ooh, let me turn that off, y'all. Well, we see some Cayman, so we're gonna go snag. I got oh, one I got cast off. I gotta turn my light back on. Oh, I see. Oh, yeah, he's right on the other side. Can we walk to that other bridge? Yeah, we can. Okay. Okay, there's a big one down here. We can't get to, we're gonna go check another bridge. Check out the opposite side. So we got... Dude, I cannot believe how many Cayman are here. Okay, y'all, these are extremely invasive and toxic Bufo marinas. And those are the big marine toads, native to Suriname and whatnot. And you can see the gland right behind the ear. And there's some white. That is actually venom. Okay, let's see and it's highly mind. toxic to animals. If the dog chews on one of those, the dog is dead. But there's three of them right there. Yeah, but you're right about the, uh, the glands. Uh, and this like, is a um, big... Whitish. Oh, that's yeah. a big mofo. Yeah. Oh, he here's the uh, glands right here. Yep. <laughs> that will kill a dog dead. Yes, sir. Those things are terrible. And you can see they have no predators. No, they got no fear. Yeah, no fear at all. Flip your news. Flip your news. Oh, he's just going to come home with us. <laughs> hey, Sean. Uh -huh. um, whoa, whoa, whoa. You got him? Yeah, I got him. Oh, hell, can you hold that baby? I got him. Yeah. I just need him one. Of him. He was a big one. Yeah, this is a good size. Yeah, he is. He's a male, I believe, also. Yeah, with the... Uh, the claw, that big one? Yep. Get another claw. Okay, let me walk out this way. Make sure I don't get pinched because that might suck. <laughs> yeah. 
That's where the get <laughs> his ass. That big ass claw right, right here. Right you want to duck him into him? Yeah, I am. <laughs> oh, you got him? Yeah. I got people that'll stick their hands so in the this is one holes for them. I wouldn't do it. Prime meat right here. That is, man. Um, when people like to mention that they want to eat rice with crab or uh, anything that's local, uh, food-wise that's made with crab, this is the type of crab they're usually talking about. Uh, we got the Maryland blue crabs, mud crabs, and you know the the tiny ones, the hermit crabs. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But the ones that are good eating are these guys right here. We just started getting these up in South Carolina. They're invasives up there now. Oh, he's a, he's the biggest one we've seen this whole trip. <clears throat> yeah, he is. Yeah, I think he's a little bit tired, so we're gonna release him. Yeah, let's see ya. Yeah, he's not snapping. No. He would with a finger, though. With the small one. You know, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Small one is uh, the dangerous one. Big one won't, won't cut. See, he already, already got a good hole of that. Thing. Look at the claw. He also has some marks right here. Oh, yeah, he's scarred right there. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's the biggest one we've seen. Everybody. Live or shells. Oh, he's going for your toes, man. I know. Oh, there, buddy. Okay, he sees us now. He's like, I am out. Okay, YouTube, can you see all the bats? That's a lot of bats. There's a lot of bats. They're coming into the light for bugs. There goes one, there's a couple. I hope these come out on video for y'all, because there's a ton of them. I know, it's really cool. They are. Visibility-wise. This is a good mud bank over here. Pretty snaggy in there. Oh, there's cows. See them up there? Oh, uh, maybe it's a horse. All I saw was eyes and brown. Yeah. There it is. I don't know if y'all can see him. He's, a, he's bigger than I thought. He's 18, maybe 20 inches, which is still small. But he's tripoding right now. There is another one of those marine toads, also called cane toads. And you can see he's sitting on that cow patty because the bugs are coming to it. So that's his little all-night buffet right there. He's talking probably his roach right here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, hold this. I'm trying to produce yeah. the fire. Oh. Yeah, you're too slow, man. I am, man. Oh, uh, he's moving on. That was it for yesterday. Even with the boat failure, we did some scouting on foot. Brought the snag rod, brought two snag rods, and we saw an absolute ton of caiman. Way, way, way more than I was expecting to see. The biggest one was a little over two meters. Um, we were in some backwater areas. It was primarily a nursery. Tons and tons of smaller ones. Um, like I said, the biggest one was a little over two meters. And we're definitely going to be going back. Um, we are trying to figure out a boat situation right now. But I'm going to wrap this video up. I don't know what we're doing today. Are we going snorkeling or you want to go surfing? Yeah. Real Babes wants to go surfing. I want to go snorkeling. I want to go try to grab some lobster. But whatever we do, y'all are coming with us, and we will see y'all today. Love you.